sea of solidarity in the House gallery showing women wearing white in support of the women's suffrage movement, including the president's daughter, Tiffany Trump. The House Democratic Women's Working Group said wearing suffragette white is, quote, a declaration that women will not go back on our hard-earned rights. And the president partly acknowledged the strides made by women. No one has benefited more from a thriving economy than women who have filled 58 percent of the newly created jobs last year. President Trump managed to get the Democratic women wearing white on their feet, including Democratic House Speaker Nancy Pelosi donning a white blazer behind him. We also have more women serving in Congress than at any time before. That's great. Really great. And congratulations. That's great. It's not the first time the color of women's clothing has been used to send a message. In 2017, the same group coordinated Democratic women wearing white to Trump's joint address to Congress. In 2018, several women wore all black to the State of the Union as a tribute to the Me Too movement. Well, a man wore white, too. Take a look. This is Representative Dean Phillips of Minnesota. And many of you maybe have noticed those pins. You can see him wearing it right there. Era, yes. That's in support of the Equal Rights Amendment.